Dr. Malik Mohammed, co-founder and vice president of Research Twin Health. For the past few years, one of the boom in management of diabetes is the continuous glucose monitoring invention. It precisely helps in monitoring the sugars every 15 minutes or 5 minutes depending on the kind of sensor we use, which helps the physician to offer the right care. There are other tools to uh, like app to uh, nudge the members to take medic medicines uh, at the right time because management of diabetes requires exact medications to be taken at the right time. And those had come through, but I see the continuous glucose monitoring is one of the uh, advancement which is really supporting people in a big way, especially in type 1 diabetes. It helps in the type with, with insulin pump and other better management of diabetes is offered by CGM. Absolutely, when we are able to get continuous data, we are able to look at the data live. Though in India there is a restriction on live data to be uh, looked at, we can go uh, swipe it uh, appropriately whenever required and look at the data. And doctors can understand to what level the body has responded to what kind of food or whatever has initiated that higher sugar level appropriately doctor can uh, monitor it and one of the biggest advantage with the uh, digitalization is especially during the era of covid uh, it really helped the doctor to remotely manage the diabetes in a very big way the idea behind the twin health if i ask me it was nature's call is what i, I would have to tell because as part of my phd work uh, at iit madras i had done my research in mobile computing and in the last part of my thesis, I might have spoken about how precision treatment through with technology can be revolutionary in the future. And interestingly, and uh, sad thing is, I had my son undergone a liver transplantation where based on that, I had some research done. I was talking about how sensors could be implanted on patients for a transplantation to be better monitored, wherein the side effect on the immunosuppressive drugs could be uh, uh, substantially reduced. So. Uh, in a common platform where I was a speaker, I happened to bump into Dr. Jahangir Mahmoud, the great man, who was the inventor of Wi-Fi through mobile phones, who has revolutionized the world of IoT, who had a vision of doing something big in the world of healthcare. Because he, through the IoT, he was able to offer a healthcare solution on the automation for automobiles, communication networks. So he had the next avatar on the healthcare. We met on a common platform, both of us were talking at the same language. So we came together and we started to dig deeper uh, to understand where should we land up. And in a particular dinner meet where he found his uncle and out of six people, four people were with diabetes. He thought, wow, high sugars in the blood is not a disease by itself. It's a symptom. The actual disease is the disruptive metabolism. Though the healthcare people are completely familiar with this, that was surprising for us. Then we were able to understand that metabolism is so complex, dynamic and we don't have a way to precisely measure the uh, disruptive metabolism or for that sake metabolism. So doctors were going and treating high sugars and not, which is a symptom and not the disease by itself. Not to blame doctors, they cannot leave people at high sugars which is ridiculously bad, it can lead to other complications. So all the molecules that were there were to remove the sugars from the blood and not solve the root cause of the problem which is the actual disease, the disruptive metabolism. That is where we thought through, we could be revolutionizing if at all we create a technology to measure the metabolism. And that is where the genesis of what Jahangir has done in his earlier avatar in Jasper of building a digital twin on automobile sector, he, we thought through and felt that we should try to build a whole body digital twin, which is what is had made many things possible today. And that is what is today a thing which is looked upon in revolutionizing world on not managing diabetes and not managing chronic disease, but reversing and normalizing chronic disease. And that is where we are today. So very, very proud about our whole body digital twin, which has got patented and which has got scientific evidence today that we can reverse or in fact remission diabetes and other chronic conditions. Uh, though there is a technology, uh, the whole body is there, 
the treatment factors are there, but someone should understand that it is a treatment because no medication titration or change in anything related to medicine can be done other than doctors. So we are very clear it is a treatment offered by doctors where twin is offering a solution for doctors to offer precision treatment to their patients. Right? And how does it work is we put in basic sensor on patient's body, harmless, non-invasive and try to create a mimic of a human. We create a digital twin of a human wherein we are able to precisely understand the dynamic nature of the body and precisely what is good for me, what is bad for me, what is that this body wants at this point of time is offered by the digital twin by which we are able to retract the body and take the body to a normalized zone. And we had been very, very successful in demonstrating this and we had been partnering with this with doctors. When we go talk to doctors about this particular amazing technology, they are embracing it in a big way. They feel that this is what they had been waiting for. And we did not have real challenge in convincing doctors because it was like as if the doctors were really waiting for such a kind of solution. And you name any big endocrinologist across the country or across the globe, they were immediate enough and uh, embracing it. But the only thing that they wanted to, uh, uh, they asked us was, do you have a scientific evidence for it? Do you have a scientific publication based on a randomized control trial? Yes, we did have a randomized control trial. And that gave us an amazing reversal rate of around 94% and 85% in the remission. And this was submitted in American Diabetic Association, the prestigious forum which decides a protocol for diabetes and they researchers there realized the kind of amazing transformation that the whole body digital twin can offer because we proved that three percentage reduction in a1c was possible and such a huge percentage of reversal of 94 percent was possible which was mind-boggling and first of its kind in the world so american diabetic association picked up in a big way and they did a press release to make people aware, especially to the professional community, know that the technology is going to the future and there is a demonstrated uh, way that this could be handled in a big way. Now we are planning to raise series D funding. We are working towards that, though we have a good run rate to handle it. For expansion across both in India and US, both in the vertical of the business model as well as on the research, we are in the process of raising series G funding, by the end of this year, we'll be able to complete it. And by the end of the year, the world will be looking at a huge, innovative, transformational company in a big, with a big valuation.